Welcome back, muscle cookers. It's been a while. It's Liam, head chef over at themusclecook.com, and I've got an amazing one tray recipe for you here today. Now, we want to simplify nutritious recipes and make them as easy as possible for you. So in this recipe, all you're going to need is one tray and you can literally throw all the ingredients in and pop it in the oven. It makes four servings, it's absolutely delicious. I had a little trial run with it last week and I just had to film it for you guys. So if you guys are ready, we're going to get straight into the recipe. I know you're going to love it. Let's go. Okay guys, so getting straight into it, we're going to go for the marinade. So we're going to go for one tablespoon of garlic, three tablespoons of runny honey, and then we're going to go for two tablespoons of Dijon mustard. Now it's important to go for Dijon because it's not as harsh as your regular English mustard. Then we're going to go for three teaspoons of cracked black pepper, a little bit of rapeseed oil, and we're going to go in with one whole orange. You're going to zest it and juice it. And just squeeze it there and get all the juice in there. And then all we're just going to do is just mix all this together and then put it to the side and we're going to prepare our chicken breasts. Okay, so we've got the chicken breast. Now you just want to cut a few slices in. You don't want to go all the way in. This is just to allow it to absorb the marinade. So there you go, you can see straight in the chicken breast here. We're just gonna add them in and marinate them. And you don't really need to put this in the fridge for long, but if you're making it ahead of time, that's totally fine. Now we're gonna to get to making the little garden of herbs and juices. So we're gonna cut up one orange and you're just gonna place that at the bottom of your tray and then make a little sort of bed garden with some rosemary and lemon thyme. It's important that you use lemon thyme here because we're going for that citrus feel. So just spread it all out, then throw in some garlic cloves, add in your baby potatoes, and then just add a little bit of rapeseed oil again with some salt, just so you can get the seasoning right. Place your chicken breasts on top, and then we're just gonna add the remaining marinade, but leave a little bit back because we're gonna pull them out halfway and then add them even more in. Okay, so that's been done halfway now, 20 minutes. Now we're just going to add the remaining marinade on top and then pop them back in for a further 20 minutes at the same temperature. And there we go, guys. So now pull the chicken breasts out and we're just going to leave them to rest for a couple of minutes. Pull all the potatoes out and then pour the remaining resting juices into your tub here. And then you can just build up your dish and then pour the remaining juices over. And guys, this is so moist and succulent. It's an absolute treat and it's full of nutrition, you guys are gonna love it. So you guys know what to do, like up the video and I'll see you next week. Hi guys, hope you enjoyed that video. Remember to hit that like button. Now, we all know that people say that eating clean costs a lot of money. I beg to differ. That's why I've put together this plan here that shows you how you can do your full week shop within your meal plan for $75 or less. You've got a full shopping list, full meal plan, and a full guide on how to save money. All my little tips and tricks that's gonna help you smash your supermarket shop every single week. So click there and you can get your free ebook, free meal plan, free shopping list, and I hope you enjoy it. Thanks for watching.